Hello ladies and gentlemen, I'm the Marmoset and welcome back to City Skylines. What are we up to? Well, we are losing money at alarming rate. Why? Because we are trying to get a posh mall, which requires me to have a tax rate flat of 10% for 20 weeks. I think I have enough money to do this. We've just hit three weeks. We're also waiting for this to recognise. Oh, not this one. No, not the courthouses. Uh, this one to recognise that for... Um, 10 weeks we've had 7 universities built over the course of playing the game so having just built the next one yes I know, high school's on fire, fire department will deal with it while we wait we might as well do just a little bit of building, not a lot we don't want to completely run out of all of our money but we're looking at talking about building in this area so we might as well just carry on building this area I want it to be low density uh, housing again um, I've not really got a style, we've done lots and lots of curves previously, so I was just probably going to put a very straight trunk road down the middle of it and yeah you are going to be living under a flight path you're just going to have to deal with it and I was thinking you know what we've not done triangles we've simply not done triangles it's just not been a thing we've been looking at are we going to connect this district in over here um, it's quite a long district actually when you consider the size of it compared to other areas to not have more than one entrance or only not have more than one connection so if I look over here what I can do is connect it via that way so we will put in a road that goes all the way over here comes up crosses over and then connects like that so that's technically quite an unpleasant junction but it will work do you have no you don't have a power connection the other way so I do need to make sure that fits in there. All right, now we can probably tweak a few of those power lines out. Like so. How are we doing overall power? Power of it is fine. I'm reasonably happy with that. Right, okay, so you're all connected up as much as I care to. Yeah, you're yeah, fine. Right, good. So the next thing we were going to be looking at was... Oh yeah, we just deleted some power lines. So that means I've got a few gaps I can fill in and just increase uh, people. Okay. So yes, triangles. Triangles, 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 and triangles. So, uh, now before I get too excessively inv inv invested in triangles, let's... Uh, Let's put the connection in over here, and we will probably actually use a... You're enormous. Nope, you're huge. You're far too big. Let's um, trim that down a little bit. It's a six lane about, apparently. We don't need that big a roundabout. So, let's just go for one of these, and well, since we're talking triangles, Let's do what we've done previously, which is create a square about. Well, let's get a diamond given the angle it's at. Connect onto there. So that essentially is an interchange mechanism. And now we grab highways and do connections. Like that. Like that. That's getting it back out that way. Oops, no, I already want to use start climbing. So that is an out that goes to that road. I need an out. Alright, looks like we'll be splitting that one. This is, uh, well, I can get my arc round, I can't actually get it to connect to anything. So you go around to there. One of you come up to there, come back down, the other one, carry on the ground and connect to that. So that connects to the roundabout, which means you can go that way, and then the other pretty much any other direction. So I have an out that goes that way, I have an out that goes this way, I've got one, two, three ins that connect all that way. I've got a road there should you bizarrely need it. Doesn't mean you can 
buses can turn around. Right, that's that bit at that end. That's that bit at that end. Now we wanted triangles. Triangles, I say. How am I going to put my triangles in this one? Well, I'm just going to have straight lines, please. A road that comes off. Ooh, so I do have the angle thing. Which can I set it to? Well, let's try my head. So if I have that one come out two, we we'll cross one, leap those two, and you come back out that way, connect up, like that. There we go, a triangle. Right. One, two, three, leap. I think that's the middle, yep. And then we take those two, let time pass. Don't keep pausing it as much as you might want to. One, two, and up. And then one across. And then we hit you. Those two. And have another triangle. One, two, up. One more across. And then we hit that one. Ooh, no, that's arcing. No, we don't arc in the triangle district. You have straight roads in the triangle district. One, two, three, and four. It doesn't look like we've got space for one more, but that can be readily adjusted by trimming that back a little bit. Across you come one, two, and three. Up to there, and then we delete one, two, and three. And complete our triangle. So, now we need to plug that road in, so you can just come out to here, and then come down, and then we'll just connect you up like that. Done. So what I will do, what's that alert? Building is burned down. I don't care. I truly don't care. A big garbage problem. No, it's a pretty small garbage problem. Did I not put a fire station next to... I did, it's there. And there is someone going to that fire. Right. Right. Where is your nearest garbage disposal? There, that's not very well connected to the centre of the city. Let's um, take advantage of the fact that we've got a bit of space over here that no one appears to care about too much and suddenly dash off and do something a little bit different um, which is to put a... what have I got underneath here? Lots of subway, so I should be able to run a single road underneath Let's stick a road in like that To there, come to there, come up, to there, and then connect. And we will want power to be out there, we will want not bizarrely far from any possible source of water. I did note that I broke that line. Around it, we want just paint that uh, office colours. So we are going to stick in some incinerators here. They don't fit that side. That's absolutely fine. I wasn't expecting to fit that many in, but I just wanted to provide just a little bit more garbage disposal for my city centre. Because otherwise it doesn't have a lot. Why do I not put ones over here? Because I don't want to spoil the view. It's a beautiful view across here. And if I put incinerators in there, it would just look kind of ugly. And I don't want to do that. I just don't want to look ugly. I don't want to do it. So, we've got a load of triangles on that side. And now we should put a load of triangles down the other side. Don't pause it. We're deliberately trying to lose money. 
Speak of which. Eight weeks. No, it doesn't look, look, look too bad. But anyway, it was out. Three, I believe, wasn't it? Yes. And then across one, across one, and then we need two and do that. And so what we'll do is I will just string a road that is straight all the way out to here and then just go like this. And then we'll grab our deletion tool and take out one too many roads. No, I have failed you all, my viewers. I'm a disgrace to road building and other such things. And then we need to take out that one, that one, that one, and that one, I think. But we'll find out soon enough. Get to there and there, you connect to there and there. You're definitely in the wrong shape. <laughs> so it won't necessarily be doing it quite as easy as I hoped. Doesn't have really worked out as well, so I will put them back in. And then it's out three across and across. Oh no, I wrong button there. No, button wrong again. I've got my eye partially on my cash flow problem because I am very aware that money is ticking down and I am in the midst of doing some building right notice our commercial demand is coming up quite nicely that's pleasing to see. Uh, I am actually just going to right delete that one um, because that's actually on a flight path. <laughs> the, the planes are at a point where they are best to be described as low, a very technical term, which means they will, will land in gear, may or may not have ended up embedded in your house. This is not a place where one should ever think about flying a kite. Two in, and then we go delete. delete. Like so. Right, and we've got our set of triangles. Pretty significant commercial demand. Not entirely sure how I'm going to meet that given I was originally intending to be making this a residential area. But I suppose what we can do in that case is a quick pause. No, don't pause it. How are we doing? Oh, we've got the Grand Library. Huge library, so many books that no one's been able to read them all. That is quite a big library, isn't it? Where should we put this nice library? Where should we put this nice library? Well, pretty much everything else is going in this district, so we should probably put it in this district. This is the district I keep these things. Slope too steep. Ready off by by what? These are all private buildings. Those are all private buildings. Slope is too steep. Could I perform some terraforming? That's meant to be level terrain. Um, I'd like that to be the level I'm leveling it to, please, rather than you know making it really much, 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 much deeper. Come out of here and just basically raise this area up as much as we possibly can. We've not done pretty much any terraforming previously. So let's make a nice space for our new expensive library. Let's try and flatten these contours off as best we can. Alright, this is not costing us too much money. We do apparently have plenty of soil available. Alright, let's see if our library will fit now. Yes it does. Tuck it right in there. 
in what were you? Luxury hotel next to the Grand Library. Look at that view, the Grand Library. The other thing I had noticed, we've not put in our business park. You're not too big. So where... What is this to say? Those busy lunch hours and teeny breath of fresh air office workers would like to visit the business park for a comment to the Eden Project. So where are my... Where's the button? Businesses are in this district. We don't have a lot of what you would call office space, do I? We really don't. There isn't an immediate demand for them. But they are all down the centre. So let's grab you. Unfortunately, you're not a hideous shape, so I can actually fit you in. Right on that corner. Dash. I bet you're a perfect fit. Look at that. Look at that. Beautiful. They'll rearrange themselves. We've got a large commercial demand coming in. It's mostly because we just filled all this in. Look at that. Yeah, well, that's filled in. So we do need more shopping. Hmm. But we've run out of room. We really have. I don't, gotta, don't really want to increase you to big tower size. So it looks like this district down the centre of here is probably going to be a mix of things. So let's talk about a mix of things. And so I want let's do bucket painting. Uh, no, nope, I didn't want high density residential. I wanted low density residential on those bits. Of the triangles. And pause. Time is ticking by. We're halfway there. And carry on with it. these ones. So low density on these bits. I know. We might be able to put some kind of district in there. Triangles, 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 triangles. Right, so that's that sorted out. What we need to do then is Rather than have that, I will come out and almost essentially rebuild it. Don't ask too many questions. One that way, and one that way, and then delete. Come out like that. Um, no, I am going to downgrade that road. Uh, that's just too large. It is needlessly large. Like so. Downgrade that size, and I am going to zone you for business I'm going to zone all of this is low density commercial there we go, that should satisfy some of our commercial demands certainly, I'm going to leave that unzoned, so there we go there's our triangles based district. I paused it again. I keep doing that, my apologies. Our triangle based district, filling that section in. Um, not many people are going to move in immediately because, you know, power. Lots of other problems with it. So, we can probably run a power line along the edge here. There we go, cross that road. Keep crossing that road. And basically just do the same. And this side of it. Make sure we've got plenty of power. Right, that's that done. Now I want the water. Let's run pipe up the middle. Just really broadly painting with these right now. It's reached the point where I have so much money and 
so much income he says we're losing 117,000 a month or a week what was it we were looking for it's the posh mall what have we got 12 of 20 is that my daily loss or my weekly loss weekly well it needs to be well, that's far far larger than he loans is there any Let's just pause it and let's turn that off Tax raise, increase rate balance, that won't count. Encourage biking, no. There's nothing I can really do. Well, there is a little bit. I could go to my budget and significantly spend a lot less on airplanes and taxis. Unique buildings, there's 32,000. I can halve parks, I can halve. This lot I'm going to leave exactly as it is. Pretty much happy with the rest of that. Um, if I tweak it with the buses, all hell breaks loose because they just decide, oh, we want to go over here, oh no, I want to go over there, or no, I want to go over there. And it just kind of gets a bit weird. Um, and that will pay me. I could take that loan if it gets really desperate, but it only lasts a couple weeks. As it is, I've arranged it such that um, it won't be too bad. Right, so apparently we do have people building in, so that's water. Apparently we need to suck more water out. Alright. We will do soon. I'll keep an eye on that one and actually react to it when it happens. But Let's quickly leave it unpaused. Start ticking along now. Garbage. We need some refuse collection over here. Hmm. Hmm, he said. Hmm. Let me do what we did previously. And then in the next episode. No, find a straight road. There we go. Right. Road down. Can you let me connect into that roundabout or not? Not is the answer. All right. There we go. What are we doing? We are doing what we did previously, which is. To, uh, it's already connected up. Put in. Oh, I might as well generate the spare power. A whole selection of them to make sure that, you know, there's garbage disposal available. That's getting nice and busy, isn't it? It did warn us that this might be something to look at. We'll have to flag that as something to look at later. What's it causing? It's the traffic switching over here appears to be the main problem, and then people are just trying to get over there and into the main district. So I might put some kind of loop on the inside of this, but we'll have to worry about that after we've managed to build up our cash flows. Right. 4% tax rate apparently is not the greatest for long term work. Commercial demand is settling. We were looking at that was garbage. Now we're looking at hospitals. I think we just kind of have to wait a little bit. And run the clock down. Yes, I know I can't afford it. Seven more weeks. We're losing less than a hundred thousand a week at the moment, which is vaguely sustainable. So we'll see. Hopefully at the beginning of the next episode I will be able to tell you that we achieved this. I'm not going to spend any more money until we've actually got it, and then I can bump the tax rate up, and then we can put the extra buildings in we need along here. But right now we're just going to have to wait. I've been the Marmoset. I'm spending all our money on a massive burst of low taxes. Not because I liked my people, it's because I want to build a posh mall. Just to get the extra bits and pieces here and there.
As it is, thanks for watching. This has been Animalia and the City Skylines game of the After Dark expansion. Please remember to like, subscribe, and comment on how the rain falls down on our spending spree.